Hey guys, in this video I will give you 5 reasons why you should sketch with a pen instead of a pencil. Every time someone tells you that they are learning how to draw or are getting into sketching, they will most likely be drawing with a pencil. Now growing up I always drew with a pencil. It was fun, easy and carefree. You make a mistake, no problem. Erase and try again. You can draw however you want. Shading with a pencil is super easy too. You have control over how much pressure you can apply on the pencil and create any level of shade you want. You can smudge the graphite with your thumb if you want to or you can use a blending stump to get any shade you want. The level of control you have with a pencil is insane and I would still recommend using a pencil to draw your perspective lines or any guidelines that you want to use to draw your drawing. That brings me to the question, why is sketching with a pen better than sketching with a pencil? You must be wondering why I'm asking you to do that. Well here are my 5 reasons why you should try sketching with a pen instead of a pencil. And if you stick to the end of the video, I will give you a little cheat code that I use myself sometimes when I am sketching with a pen. Number 1. It helps you lose bad habits. Well because you can't afford to make any mistakes while drawing with a pen, you draw more carefully. Pay a little bit more attention. That means that if you have any bad habits in drawing like short searching lines or loose lines that don't go anywhere, you would be a little bit more careful when drawing them. That extra bit of thought that you would have to put before drawing each line would make you a much better artist and make your line quality in general so much better than when you're drawing carelessly with a pencil. You would have to think every time you draw a line and there are no wasted lines and every bit of effort that you put into your drawing counts. Number 2. Time Sketching with a pen is way faster than sketching with a pencil. With a pencil, you have to first lay the base layer, then lay down a couple of other layers of graphite before you can get to your final level of depth. While with a pen, a single stroke is enough to convey the message. You can draw a super detailed drawing really fast because only one stroke is enough to convey whatever you're trying to do and your lines won't blend in with each other. Also, you don't have to make sure that your pencil is always sharp and pointy so there's no constantly having to sharpen your pencil after a few strokes. Sometimes when I'm drawing a complicated drawing I would pick up a fine tip pen like a 0.05 or 0.1 mm and draw the entire drawing in one flow and I don't have to stop and redo any of the lines. That's one of the reasons why sketching with a pen is so much faster than sketching with a pencil. That brings me to reason number 3 why you should sketch with a pen instead of a pencil. Sketching with a pen allows you to have lines of varying thicknesses, while with a pencil you are usually drawing with a pointed tip. Even though you have different levels of blackness with pencil and you can choose between a range of graphite from 8B to HB to 8H, pen allows you to have anywhere from 0.05 mm to 1 mm and even thicker. Number 4. Blending with other mediums When you're sketching with a pen, a big advantage is its ability to blend in with other mediums. Yes, it's possible to draw a pencil sketch and then color with a marker or watercolor, but I have experienced that it just doesn't quite work the way it works with a pen. The pen kind of stands out behind your colors and makes the drawing pop out even more and have a stronger impact. The two that I have used the most are alcohol based markers and watercolor. A pen sketch can be a great base for drawing watercolor or markers. The colors lay fluidly on top of the sketch and there is no blending or disturbing the original sketch. If you are outdoors and want to sketch a landscape scene, adding colors is a must and a pen just works so much better than a pencil here. Which brings me to point number 5. Drawing with a pen gives your drawing a distinctive appearance. Because you can't afford to make any mistakes with a pen, the approach to drawing is a little different. Now there are two ways that you can go from here. Either you are too careful when drawing so that you freeze up and overthink it, or you manage to conquer that fear of making mistakes and reach a level of confidence where you can just enjoy the process. It may take some time, but with practice you can truly embrace the process of drawing with a pen. It is okay to make mistakes as every mistake adds to the overall story and when you reach the end, you can see the whole journey of how you got there. 
So those were the five reasons why I would recommend try sketching with a pen instead of a pencil. And if you stuck around till the end, as promised, let me get you in on a little cheat code for drawing with a pen. So you all know that you can't really fix any mistakes when drawing with a pen, except there is kind of a way that you can do that. It's this little eraser from Pelican. Now, it doesn't quite erase ink the way a typical eraser erases pencil, but it will get you out of a tough spot. As you can see, it's literally eating into the page, kind of shredding it a little bit, making it a little thinner. So you can only use it sparingly and only when you really need to, and only for very small little marks like this. I don't usually need it, but every now and then I need to use this little cheat code if I have to. But I would try to stay away from this cheat code as much as possible, because it's only to get you out of tough spots where you can't really fix a mistake that you've made. And you can only fix smaller mistakes. Uh, if, if it's bolder, thicker lines, uh, there's really no way to erase that. So a couple of recommendations here. My go-to pens are the Sakura Pigma Micron Fine Liner pens. Uh, you may have seen them in most of my videos. Uh, I really like them. They have a good variety of thicknesses and they've been my go-to for uh, quite a bit of time. Another option is Unipin Fine Liner Drawing Pens. Uh, these are pretty good too, I've used them before, uh, pretty reliable. And if you want to go with fountain pen, uh, I haven't used myself any personally, but that's another option as well. And if you want to go with ballpoint, which is also a good option for pen drawing, I would go with a big pen. Uh, these are pretty good ballpoint pens for sketching as well. And I will leave down uh, links for these in the description below, you can check them out if you want. Well, that's the end of the video and uh, as always, thanks for watching and uh, I will see you in the next one. Cheers.